Hello, my friends, recently I received orders from you of making animation tutorial of bushes, so here it is. This tutorial might be a little bit hard for beginners. If you know about fundamental operations of Magic of Oxel, I think it won't be too hard for you. Create a new file and delete our old friend, the blue cube, and create limb of the bush, so that we can put leaves on it later. The shape of bush is totally up to you. Adjust the shape until you feel good. When finish the edit, choose the limbs and press U to combine them in one object. Use attach brush and change the diameter of dot to add some group of leaves. Make more bushes by copy and paste. Change location of them. Choose several objects and press U to combine them if you finish the edit. Apply some gradient green colors to bush. Pick and deleted colors in order to reduce the density of bush. Pick another green color and paint on the highlights of bush. We will animate that part of leaves later. I put the animate part on the other layer, so it will be easier to find.
Now we have a beautiful and natural bush now. And also we have the highlights of bush separately. Let's start the animation part. Create keyframes and loop the highlight, like it rippled in the breeze of summer night. Preview and confirm the animation by dragging mouse on frame panel. Delete or add frames to control the frequency of moves. Copy bushes to create the scene. Change the render image size to full screen size. Change ground color as you like. For me, I think some houses beside will be better. Let me put a house from my storage. Increase the feeling of depth by set proper aperture. The simultaneous move of bush looks unnatural. Let's suppose the wind comes from opposite of the house. And, bushes moves one by one. All we need to do is to delay the keyframes of move by distance. Make the scene more interesting by adding more natural elements.
Edit the render images to movie and get the animation file. I will add a link of how to combine images to movie by using Davins. How does it looks? Make some creative retouches if you like. That's all for today's tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you in next video.